In this video, I'm going to show you how you can convert video files into the MP4 H.265 format using any video converter, which is a free download. So if you haven't downloaded this program, I will put the link in the description, or you can just do a Google search for it. So let's open up any video converter. So once the program opens in the center here, it will give you the options to either add or drag your video file. So let's add a file. So for example, if I want to convert a movie, so say this one here into the forest, it's an MKV file format. So let's select this one. So if I want to convert this into the MP4 format, so what we want to do here is focus in the top um, corner, right hand corner here and select this option here. And you can see if you go down a bit and you can select here video files, so set the video files option down here. And if you scroll down again, you should see common video file formats here. So what we're looking for here is customized MP4 movie or just MP4. Make sure you don't select M4V, which is similar. So select the MP4 and then focus on the right hand side menu around here. So you can see here is my video file name. Is the output folder where it will be saved once it's been converted. You can select a start time here as well if you wanted, or a stop time, such as so. That's up to you. You can also choose the video size. So again, if it's 1080p, to select the original. You can downgrade it to a lower resolution you want to. There's no point upgrading it to a higher resolution as the quality won't be affected. So just select original. A quality, you can select normal again. So the most important thing to get the correct format is to, is to select the video option here. So once you do that, make sure the video code here is to X265 rather than 264. So select 265. Again, you can select the video bit rate, which will affect the quality. So again, you can, by default, it's on 2000. Again, you can choose the original if you want to. Uh, frame rate, again, should be automatic 25, uh, aspect, auto, and so on. You can also change the audio options you want to, but there's no point. So once all that's done, just make sure this to the 265 you can then convert your video. So bear in mind when you are converting a full size movie, the process will be quite slow, especially if it's in the original quality. It might take an hour, if not two hours to complete. So click convert. It will then give you an estimation time. So once it's done, it should be saved in, in the destination you saved it. In most cases, as I said before, just open up your file folder, select your videos, and you should see here any video converter select here and it should be in this section here so that's how you do it thanks for watching